Sara Lago. I'm the shooting star from Spain. And, um, well, I, I did this movie called Bunker last year, and I think they're going to um, show the teaser here because they're still finishing it. But um, it's a very cool movie. I read the script and I just fell in love with it. It's kind of like a thriller, suspense movie, um, drama, very dramatic, what happens to my character especially. Um, and it's about this couple that uh, falls in love and they go to Colombia, to Bogota, because he's an um, orchestra director and she goes with him, kind of follows him whatever he goes, and uh, then something happens, and she disappears, and nobody knows where she is, and I don't know if I can, you know, tell you anything more <laughs> than that, because, <laughs> you know, they're going to kill me if I do. <laughs> I guess I just, I, I always loved it. I was very, I loved movies when I was little, and, um, I just loved playing uh, different roles. I mean, instead of playing with toys like other normal <laughs> kids, I would just, you know, pretend to be, um, you know, whatever. And usually when I went to see a movie, if I liked, you know, the, the main female character, I would just imitate her for a week and I would just become her and talk like her and move like her. And so I thought, well, maybe if I like to do this so much, I could just, you know, do it as a job. Well, of course, when I started, I was 10, so it wasn't, it wasn't really like a job. It was more like a game. But that's how I, I started. I, I was very lucky because my parents knew this, um, this guy that was working at a TV show in Spain, and he, he told us that there was going to be a very small character for a 10 year old and it was just for one episode but um, I went to do an audition and they said okay so that was my first thing in TV and I just I loved it and then after that I guess somebody saw me there and they, they called me and then I got an agent my actual agent and then I got my first you know main role in a movie it was Carol's Journey, I was 11, and then I just completely fell in love with it, with the industry, with the films, with the, <laughs> with the whole thing. I don't know, I, I mean, I love acting because of, you know, what I told you, I just, I, I love playing different roles, different, you know, different people, become different people, and actually, I think it's, it can be even like a therapeutic thing because <laughs> you learn a lot about yourself when you try to become somebody else. You kind of put your own things in that and so you learn mm -hmm. about yourself. And uh, I just love the, you know, the set, the you know, going away for two months to another country or another city and and just for those two months you're just, you know, focused on that and, and you actually become something else, like with the people that, you know, you work with, it's like a huge bubble, <laughs> you know, for those two months, those are your friends, those are your, you know, that's your family and then that just pops and you move to the next bubble and it's, I mean, it's kind of sad at the end, but that thing about moving so much and meeting so many people, I, I love that. And I love the festivals and, you know, the parties. <laughs> I just love everything about it. That would be, yeah, that's a dream that I, that I have. I would love to work. Um, First, I would love to work in English, because I love English, <laughs> so I really want to try that. And also, working outside of Spain means, you know, kind of 
seen other ways of uh, working in, in this uh, industry. And I, I don't know if it's like Hollywood, you know, like, it's your dream to go to Hollywood. Well, yes, but also France or, or Germany or England, you know, it doesn't have to be um, Hollywood. It just, I would love to work all over the world. <laughs> Well, I have to, well, the Bunker film is coming out, I guess, in May or something. And then I'm going to do this, it's, it, it's not a, it's kind of like a mini series, you know, like six episodes. It's not a TV show, like, seasons, it's just six episodes. And it's going to be filmed in Colombia again. So I'm very excited because I work with the same people that I just, you know, finished working with. And um, that's what I have in mind for now.